Hello again, squaddies. Welcome back to the inexplicable journey here in the Curious Expedition. As always, I am D. Honestly, I'm thinking of playing Huang Fei Hong here because I've played him. A, I played him once as a test out, as a test run, and he's actually really good, mostly in combat, which is what I'm going to aim for here. So we're up against Ada Lovelace, Alistair Crowley, Mary Curie, and Johan Huizinga. I don't know. All right, so we got a dryland and a jungle. Here to the jungle. And so we have to deliver a letter. Good, easy quest to start with. Gonna begin the expedition. Alright, so she, uh, okay, so Paul Henry Duran, our cook, is a racist, that's not fun. And Miss Needham, there's a water buffalo we're going to go ahead and mount up, because that costs less sanity to move. Oh, right, because he has wound treatment as a thing. He also has healer. Let's go ahead and head for the stone circle. Let's go ahead and reveal ruins. Alright, so we're gonna go ahead and promote you. Head over here. Take that. We did just flood this part of the world. Which might have just cut me off because I went the wrong way. Okay, it's not going to cut me all the way off, but it is going to be a pain. Water cut up when I washed away. Valuable items were lost. Lost one of the jewels, two torches, a first aid kit, and a lot of rope. That was just bad luck, really. Giant tree. Head down here real quick. Enter the village. Deliver the letter. Which actually gets me up to negative one standing. Not super great, but... See the lotus rest. Great, I gained a grand total of ten, 10 sanity from that. Alright, so as far as I know, we're being watched. Should be a butterfly over here, I think. Yeah, there is. It's a shaman's hut. I need to get a soldier. Oh, there's the golden pyramid. Alright, so first off, we're gonna examine the shrine, enter it. I have to take everything. So one in five chance of something really bad about to go about to happen. That decreases his loyalty to one. But oh great. Uh you know what? Let's just ditch the torch. So I managed to make it through that one. Is there anything going horribly wrong? Alright, so we got increased sanity and unresting in nature. Reduce cost in desert. Take climber. Because reduce movement cost on hills is great. 
Alright, so everybody's already returned. Gift that, gift that. Sell two of them, because I'm going to need a lot of stuff. Rich Arctic, the Looming Desert. Let's do the Looming Desert. Trader and two cultists. Right, so he's an alcoholic, and a coca expert. He is racist and a coca expert. He is superstitious and a, and has haggle. Bugger! I'll take the other. I'll take another cultist. Take all the alcohol because I need it. Take all the first aid kits because those are also useful. That'll do for now. Plus one capacity for Miss Needham. And set sail. Two full things of water. Begin the expedition. Uh, he can actually already be promoted. I don't get what it means by 80 days. It usually takes me like three to do these. Explore the shipwreck. Dynamite and climbing gear. I'll take it. Oh, damn it. Didn't mean to. I meant to actually take that. Yeah, this right here is actually why Fei Hong is great, because he has special attack dice uh, special attack dice that he can use. And each one of these gives a different ability. So like five animal fist is a damage for two and heals for two. Killing a hyena with a headbutt. Oh, actually, I do have a cook, so I can take that. Don't really care about going to a mission. Enter the stone circle, reveal all ruins. That's a temple. I like, we like temples. So we're freezing parts of the desert. Always fun. Head for the temple. Alright. Uh, Harold Obadiah, you're gonna drink. He's got claws now. The other one was a tomb. Hold on. Let it slip. Oh! Fuck you, you douche. See, I am kind enough to bring your sorry ass along on this quest. Eh, take them, take them mangoes. Attack the hyenas. Strong claws into the horns. 
Let's just shadow this kick. And we'll just headbutt and defend. Tiger Crane Fist is actually one of the better ones. I didn't even know how long that took. Waterproof, Ruffian. Dick Charismatic. Oh, wow. I'm at nine. F I'm over. 300 ahead of the next person. So Forgotten Drylands in Australia, the Deadly Drylands in that looks like Tibet, the Guajaja Arctic. We're gonna go to the Dr Forgotten Drylands down in Australia. Uh, yeah, I'll try it. Mountain Trooper, take a Mountain Trooper. Uh, sex is missing. Uh, yeah. Actually, you know what? Uh, actually, no. We're gonna just go and dismiss James. We have a ton of carry capacity. Let's get all the chocolate. Get a couple. Get quite a few shovels. Take that hunting rifle. I have eleven dollars left over. There we go. Actually, first off, all right, so it's all in a jungle tile alongside a at least three long canyon. Since, hey, guess what I just found? Two totem sticks and a golden bowl. Explore off this direction. Temple! Great. Mr. Durand has inhuman strength. A native village. Hold on a second. All right, I'm going to ditch that because that's not what I, that's what I meant to do. Oh, okay, so that. Those are just, totem sticks are all about just removing threats. All right, so let's see. No, that's not the region. There it is.
Well, they attacked us, so. One attack. Let's go ahead and just pull everything out real quick. Alright, good. We've got everything we need. Right, let's go ahead and do hoof. Claws. Iron wire fist is probably the strongest of the attacks that you can roll. Quick shot. Do a shield repost. Do a tactical advantage. Double stun. It's just that I was figured I should probably heal the one who didn't make fun of me first. Attack the gorilla. Claws. Roll those. Oh. Then throw out the ripper leap. Get a quick shot. Into a hoof. No kick. Do an iron wire fist for the kill. That's just disgusting. Dig here. The mystery box. It could be anything. Could even be a boat. I have not watched Family Guy in so long, but okay. So, oop. Old camp. Let's go ahead and explore. See what they got. Free whiskey. Leave those shovels behind. Head this way. Probably nothing over here. Yeah, I just there's nothing there's no way for me to go here. So instead. Everybody's drunk. Oh, I forgot I had the overcooked animal meat. Cancel travel. Is that a shrine? And promote private Bartholomew Overton. Use a rope. Take everything. Rearrange the entirety of the landscape in a way that makes it impossible for me to get farther along the way I was going. Keep asking the question how the hell am I gonna get. I. Yeah, as far as I know, I can't actually. I don't think I can get over there now. Because I don't have any dynamite. Unless I can just... No, I can't even... Wait, no, is that just because the hyena's there? No, it's because there's legitimately no way past. Unless I can go this way. Okay, yeah, there's legitimately no way for me to for me to finish this expedition now.
Take those, take that, take that. Okay, uh, take the mystery box because I still need that. Actually, make more room. Uh, you're staying behind. I guess that makes it so I can only take three things. Uh, take the whiskey. Actually, wait. Let's see. That's 70 fame, 40 funds. 50, 40. 70, 40. That's going away at the end of this expedition anyway, so it doesn't really matter. Screw up. Take the gun. View distance that will help some. I'm not going to gain a lot of fame. Actually, I didn't gain any fame here. Valley of the Arctic, the Humpa Lumpa Arctic, or the Tiki Taka Jungle. Take the jungle. Hundred reward. Theophilus Edwin. Yeah, the last. That's how the last cultist did with me. Oh, wait, you can't. I'm just gonna take Tim Timster and Lewis. Because he doesn't have some stupidly negative trait I have to worry about. More booze. i take one more off there. We have a ton of carrying capacity at this point. I did lose a little bit of my combat prowess ditching the old cultist, but... <laughs> and begin the expedition. We are basically traveling super light with just medical supplies, gun... Medical supplies, a gun, and booze. Alright, so I need to find... What I really need to find now is... Uh, a village. I should have brought machetes. So he's got jungle fever. Prevents promotion. Holy crap. Uh, can't go in the cave because I don't have any torches. Actually, I mean, I could have gone in the cave, but do I actually... Just uncircle, reveal settlements. That's a shrine, it's not a temple, but it'll do. Torn scalp. I'll heal him in just a moment. Quick shot. Dog. On the lookout. Not that it matters. Shoot the gorilla. There we go. Take everything. Instantly cook that. 
happens to me. Eat it. Oh, right, I forgot. Heal the dog. Heal the cook. Heal the trooper. Okay, so I'm just trying to get over this... Trying to get over to that... Crap. Ram. The Ripper Leap. Five Animal Fist, which was actually kind of pointless. I shouldn't have done that. Shoot it. Dog Claws. Roll again. In the round. Dog claws. Hoof. Oh, what the? Why did he get jungle fever all of a sudden? You guys don't have any instruments to sell, so... There we go. No, not all of them. Because he's a racist fuckhead. Temple! He's already had one. Regeneration! Very nice. Let's go up here. This is a shaman's hut. Go ahead and enter the hut. Ask for cleansing. Uh, cleanse this guy. So, okay, that does get rid of jungle fever. Is this another temple? No, it's a cave. I don't do caves. Actually, you know what? Might as well. After we kill the gorilla. I am not actually advocating for anybody to go out and shoot gorillas. Because that's just... That's just asinine. Save these. First off, we're gonna... Stable position, then dog claws. Nothing there. Shadowless kick. Doggy claws. Punctuation! Take a shot, explore the cave. I mean, I've got a very good shot at this, actually. And I didn't get it. Uh... Huh. Got it. Free whiskey, some jewels, five machetes which I could use, and some bullets. Also, I've suddenly got a humanoid abomination because why the hell not? Can I even promote this guy? Don't think so.
Damn it, I would have taken you along. You would have been useful to us. Claws, horns, ripper leap. Take the shot. This is gonna hurt. Everybody's injured. He's got regeneration. That looks like a good candidate of where the pyramid is going to be. Found it. And I'm the first one here. Uh, there. Less problems with dealing with, ju with dealing with jungles. Ada Lovelace is still out ahead of me. For now. Sell those. Sell those. And those. That. And gift that. Somehow I've managed to come back from that. Deadly Drayland's malicious... Probably take the malicious jungle. Valley of Jungle. I don't know why that's marked with a yellow name, but we're going to try it. I had nothing to offer. Snarf rattle again. Alright, so... Not for the Mercier, the artist, Sister Pippi, the missionary, or Oliver Lawrence, the cultist. Eh, might as well take this... Braces missionary. Actually, you know what? We're gonna take the soldier instead. Lieutenant Harold Albert. Sorry, Sister Pippi. Set sail with a dollar. And I just realized once again I forgot entirely to stock up on machetes because I'm an idiot. I'm promote you. This is a trade caravan. Oh. Huh. Nah, you don't. Actually, you do have some stuff I would like, but I have plenty of what I need. Shrine. Our sort of business is promote you, so we gain even more sanity from combat. Yoink! Waterfall, not important enough for me to worry about. Attack the tiger. Taming tiger fist. Humorously enough, exactly what I needed. Into the river leap, save that, roll these. Kick it. Claws. The hoof. Shoot it. And stab it. I have an insanely high amount of combat com combat potential in this.
There we go. Ooh, temple. Always take temples. Okay, you've already drank, you've already had one as well. So Lieutenant Harold Albert, your turn. He gets claws. <coughs> trying to find my way over to trying to find my way to see if I can find Snarf Rattle easily. There we are! Tiger Crane Fist. So let's take out these guys first. All right, we got everything. Let's go ahead and taunt. Quick shot. Into a kick. Into the Ripper Leap, Dog Claws, and finally a an Evade. You know what, screw it, let's just triple attack him, make it as close to his, just get it as close to dead as possible. Oh, he just died. And take that. Take everything. Well, I got Snarf Rattle's pelt. That's a shrine. Freezing. Attack the tiger. Claws. Tiger crane fist. Precise attack. Post. Quick shot. Save the hands just in case. I actually just threw them away as well. But we got the kill. Camp. There it is. All right, going to the last expedition. I got a ton of fame. Let's do gun damage. I'm carrying a rifle. Okay, the Lovelace. Lovelace gets to 1802. Johan is way in the back. Keep that one. Gift that. Get both of those. Sell those. Homey prehistoric land. Nah. I think we're good there. All the chocolate. All the med kits.
Once again, setting off with just a dollar in the bank. We're into the final expedition here. There's these. Let's go. Alright, so the first order of business is to try if I can and find the key shrines. Stone circle. Alright. Uh, yeah, whatever. What was that? A tomb. That's a cave, which actually we can go in. So we do have a torch. Yeah, cool. Oh wow, that brought me way over here. What is this? That's just a waterfall. That's another cave. Slave traders don't care. Well, actually, I do in the sense that no slave. I don't take slaves. Oh crap! Go this way. Attack the terror bird. Maximum defense. Headbutt. Keep that, roll again. Evade, roll again. End the round. Ironwire Fist kills it. Just take everything. There we go. I'm not gonna take anything from there. I've got a lot of stamina or sanity restorers. There's the pyramid. Well, that's gonna be a pain in the ass. Onward. Move 
volcano stays inactive. And of course, the second I set foot here, instantly kill the mother that we're stealing this from. Because I'm just that horrible of a person, apparently. Eh, actually, nah. So the, uh, I know another one of the shrines was over here. Way over here. Luckily, I've got a huge amount of stuff to restore sanity, so... Alright then. Strong claws, regular claws... Hold the brain... Hold the hand... Taunt. Quick shot, we killed it. Heal the dog. Heal the cook. Heal the soldier. What the fuck? Why? Oh, he is actually a pyromaniac. Kind of wish I'd noticed that before. Also really glad I made that shortcut through the mountains. Okay, first of all, let's kill this giant bird. Deadly repost. Quick shot. Iron wire, strong claws. Luckily, I've actually got enough sanity and enough speed that I can just. I can actually move pretty quickly. The other one was to the south of the pyramid. By the zombie pygmies. I've got enough alcohol to sustain anybody. I've got, tw I mean, I've got 29 bottles of whiskey. And that volcano's going off, so fun there. Screw it. We are killing the zombie pygmies. Damn it, Bartholomew. Okay, seriously, do you have to set a fire every time we stop?
Also, I just remembered. Mount the dinosaur. He's literally riding on his seat. There's a saddle right there, dude. All right. Ada Lovelace was the closest to getting to me. And I still beat her out for that. All righty. Unlocked somebody else for that one. Alexandra David Neal. Huang Fei Hong returned to the breathtaking mountains of Scotland in triumph. He's not from Scotland. He has scared his legacy with the slain statue, injured a heck life, and the knowledge that history would hold him in the highest order. Probably regard, but actually, whatever. After returning, Paul Henry Duran traveled throughout the Western world to see about those famous journeys. Avengers had left scars on his soul, and his family tested that he was now a shadow of the person they once knew. During his late life, he became obsessed with haunting visions about a remaining mysterious pyramid, disproved without any trace. Robert Bartholomew Overton returned home and became a sort of consulting detective on strange cases and queries, and he was first child, that's the name of the ship that brought him home. Long and happy life, died in the presence of Almighty God. Then Harold Albert returned to his home and lived a secluded life. For some years through his memoirs, became a big success, and allowed him to a financially comfortable life. He was accumulated wealth to be one of the first owners of a new automobile, lived a long and humble life, and died in the presence of his loving family. Well, all right then. Didn't expect that to go quite that way, but a lot of ups and downs in that one. If you enjoyed, feel free to drop a like on the video. You can also leave a comment down below if you have anything you'd like to say. And if you want to keep up with me and never miss any of my current series, and consider joining the squadron by subscribing to the channel. It does help me out, and I really do appreciate it. As for that, squaddies, I have been D. That went better than I expected, considering some of the craziness I got up to in that run, but hey, whatever. Until next time, good night, and good gaming.